Jehovah's Witnesses are being targeted in Russia, with detained believer and Danish national Dennis Christensen likening the situation to the times of Stalin. He was arrested for what Russian authorities are calling extremism. Christensen's lawyer, Anton Bogdanov, spoke more about the possible motivation for opening the case. The criminal prosecution in question is politically motivated, as the only basis for its launch and continuation is the religion he has chosen. If you were to look at the court process and what questions were asked by investigators and what questions interested the prosecutors, they were as follows. Are you a Jehovah's Witness? Were you at a Jehovah's Witness service? Christensen's defense lawyer regards these questions as criminal as they do not focus on whether or not the detained man was participating in extremism, but simply focused on the point of what religion he belonged to. As Christensen is the first Jehovah's Witness to be detained in Russia for extremism, Bogdanov worries that this could set precedent for the future. The Dennis Christensen case is the litmus test for religious freedom, not only in Oriol, but in Russia as a whole. It is worth noting that I know from my colleagues that even investigators in other regions that are working on cases against Jehovah's Witnesses are watching the course of this case and are awaiting its result to determine their next lowing actions. So unfortunately, there is no doubt that this case shows that religious freedom in Russia is not without problems today. Even facing possible prison time, Christensen and his family are holding out hope. His wife Irina says she's seen an outpouring of support for her husband. Our faith is only becoming stronger. It is always stronger in the times of hardship. So, I don't know, faith will not shake. Even in prison, no one will be able to shake it. The Constitution says one thing, that we have full rights to freely gather and freely practice our religion. But in actuality, it's not the case. Jehovah's Witnesses, a religion that has origins in the United States, has received pressure from Russia for years. In Russia's most recent clash with the West following its annexation of Crimea, the energy behind pushing out what Russian Orthodox scholars have called a dangerous foreign sect has increased. In 2017, Russia's Supreme Court declared the religion as an extremist organization and ordered it to disband. More than 100 criminal cases have been opened against Jehovah's Witnesses in Russia, and some of their publications have been added to a list of banned extremist literature.